let's get started with the first part of the video. What's been going on in my life? Everything started back in probably March. I was struggling to keep up with my videos, with ideas, with energy to do them. Just, it was really getting hard. And I thought, you know, am I getting burned out? I've been doing these videos for over a year and a half now. Maybe I just need to take a break. So I decided to take a couple of weeks off get some perspective, get some fresh ideas, and just rest for a while. So the beginning of April, I posted on Facebook that, hey, I'm taking a break, I'll be back soon. That was on Monday. On Friday, I ended up in the emergency room that afternoon and then having emergency surgery that night. I won't go into all the details. If you need to know, you know. <laughs> and if you don't know, well, you don't need to know anything other than I had a serious issue. Obviously, if they're doing surgery on me in the middle of the night, I was taken back to the OR a little after 11 that night. It was, it was a very scary, stressful situation. That was April 8th. At that point, I'm, you know, coming home, I'm dealing with recovery, having some other issues in the middle of recovery, and then two weeks and two days later, my dad died. Yeah, let me take a break here for a second. So, um, he was 92, had been in poor health wasn't unexpected but then again wasn't really expected you're never ready even when you think you are i um uh, had an appointment for a follow-up from my surgeon two days later my family graciously waited for me to find out from my doctor if I could travel because my family lives in Tennessee and we are in Texas. After I did my follow-up with my surgeon, um, he's like, do you have any questions? And I said, yes, can I get on an airplane this afternoon and fly to Tennessee? Explain what was going on. He said, yes, you can if you can give, your shot, uh, give yourself a shot of Heparin, which is a blood thinner because of the increased chance of me developing a blood clot while flying because of the surgery. I said I can do anything I need to do to be able to get on that plane. I gave myself the shot. Uh, before I came back to Texas, I had someone else give me the shot because I wasn't sure I could do it the second time. But it, it all worked out. I was able to go home and be with my family that week. And uh, then we came back to Texas. <sighs> my recovery was an up and down roller coaster ride as I was going through everything. It was very difficult. And it took a couple of months for me to really get back to 100% as far as recovery from the surgery. Um, I have recovered from that, but dealing with other issues now, I uh, found out that I'm anemic, so I'm having to take those vitamins now. Dealing with a lot of other issues health-wise, I am just inundated with doctor visits into July. So, yeah, just a lot going on with me medically and then health issues within the family that I can't go into because they're not my issues and I want to respect their privacy. My emotions as I'm processing everything and you know, sometimes I just don't feel like making a video. I have not felt like making a video for two months now. I'm ready for life to get back to normal and I know that this is part of my normal. It's something that I enjoy doing. It's 
a creative outlet for me and I just need to get back to it. So I'm pushing through and doing this so that I am getting my life back, at least as much as I can. On top of all of those issues, um, my husband has gotten a new job. It is not <laughs> where we live and he will be leaving at the end of the month. We've already signed our lease for another year. Our two youngest are going to be staying here and I will be staying here with them. I'll be visiting my husband back and forth through the next year. So that's why I haven't been around and what's been going on. Which brings me into what's coming with my channel. This is exciting to me and I hope it will be for you. I promise you that unless I'm taking a break for whatever reason, Tuesdays will be cooking video days. Fridays will be my cozy chats and other things. And I haven't decided if it will be every Friday or if it will be maybe every other Friday if the Fridays are going to have themes like maybe one is a grocery haul, one is a cleaning, one is a just a chat about whatever. I don't know. I'm still developing that but I'm going to be ruthlessly going through my house and getting rid of things. We have lived in this house for 10 years now and we have accumulated a lot and gotten rid of very little and so my goal is to cut what I have in half. If you are interested in seeing me go through that process, let me know and I can start filming those so that you can see what I do, how I do it, how I make those decisions. I will also be doing a lot of traveling this next year and so I'm thinking some traveling videos, maybe stopping at different restaurants. If I find something that is absolutely delicious, maybe coming home and trying to recreate that for you. Also, grocery hauls. I, I love watching other people come home and go through the things that they've bought. I've gotten such great ideas of things to try. In fact, I have a video. I went to Trader Joe's, wow, back in early March. That should be a video coming up on a Friday very soon. And I can do more of those if that's something that you would like to see. House hunting, when we finally do start doing that next spring, but if you guys would like to go along with me when I'm doing house hunting, I would love to take you along with me. Also, if there's other things that you might like to see or questions that you have, you know, we could do a Q&A session sometime when we move. You know, I can show you the move-in process. I can show you how I set up my kitchen. These are things that I find interesting when I watch other people do. And, you know, if it's something that you're interested in seeing, let me know. I think that's everything that I wanted to talk about as far as what's upcoming. Tuesday videos, always be cooking. Friday videos will be just a variety of things. This channel is nothing without you. So I really want to know what you want to see. Thanks for joining me today on Susan's Cozy Kitchen. If you enjoyed today's video, please be sure and give it a big thumbs up. If you're not already a subscriber, please hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so that you find out every time I upload a new video to YouTube. Thanks for joining me. God bless.